Elephants. Elephants have adapted to the environment in many ways. For example, the elephant's trunk enables it to suck up water and spray it back into its mouth. It also allows them to reach up into the trees to get leaves to eat. The trunk also lets the elephant pick up various objects. The ears are also another adaptation. In very hot climate conditions, the elephant can use its ears as a fan. Also, the large ears help them detect and hear predators. Penguins have webbed feet to help them swim better underwater. They also have streamlined bodies which allows them to feed efficiently on their prey and it reduces drag in the water. Because they cannot fly, their wings are shaped like flippers, enabling them to swim in the ocean up to a speed of about 24 km an hour. Unlike birds that can fly, penguins have heavy solid bones that let them remain underwater. They also have a layer of fat, called blubber, under their thick skin to keep warm in the cold conditions of their habitat. Another feature of the penguin which helps them adapt to the environment is their feathers. The dark feathers on the penguin's back draws heat from the sun and helps them warm up. The feathers are tightly packed to make them waterproof and warm. Trees adapt to the environment in many ways. For example, in dry deciduous forests, trees have thick bark to control the moisture evaporating from the tree's trunk. In damp tropical rainforests, trees have a thinner smooth bark, which makes it harder for other plants to grow on the surface. Many trees in the rainforest have leaves with a drip tip to allow drops of rain to run off quickly. This helps trees to avoid fungi and bacteria to grow on them. A lot of large trees have huge ridges near the bottom that help the tree to be stable because the roots of trees in tropical rainforests are not deep. There are also many other adaptations which can help living things adjust to the environment.